Now, do you know the reason why most things are expensive in Nigeria? It's not even about importation duty, maybe the transportation or all that. Sometimes we Nigerians are part of the reason why most things are expensive in Nigeria. Let me explain. Now, I need Enugu people to verify this. I also need the Enugu state governor, Pitamba, to be aware of what is happening in his state. Or maybe he's not aware, or maybe he's aware, but he needs to do something about it. Now, I've been receiving a lot of reports from Enugu people, especially the security agencies, reporting about some certain tax force in Enugu who call themselves produce I think it's produce tax force or something like that and how they've been extorting people you know making drivers to pay outrageous amount of money before they could pass some certain rules in fact they said that those tax force block some major roads and tax people motorists truck drivers people who transport goods and even services they tax them even make them to stop make them to, sometimes beat them up for example now look at this picture now the money you're seeing in your screen is a driver who was beaten up by one of those tax force i could recall a few months ago when peter mba newly became the enugu state governor when he announced or they announced that peter mba has banned those tax force illegal tax force and all that but this new tax force they call produce tax force or whatever they are really causing nuisance on the road of enugu and they are making transportation or maybe transferring of goods in Enugu difficult. And this is the reason why the Enugu state government, especially the Enugu state governor of Pitamba, need to be aware of what is happening in his state. And to also know that his state is not motorable. Most of the roads that are not good are the places that those people go to block and extort people. And also, my attention has been drawn to some local roads in Enugu where the indigenous stage a task force operation on the road and extort drivers. This is very disheartening. It is very sad that indigents will block road and extort people who transfer goods and services to pass on the road, even go as far as beating them up. See, before I say this kind of thing, I've received a lot of complaints. Now, this thing is not just happening in Enugu, it's happening in some part of Imo states. Our Igbo brothers, what is happening? Why are you people making our Southeast ungovernable or maybe difficult for our own people? It is not good. It is not good. Development is what every state wants, but when you become your own hindrance, it is not good. So, please, if you're watching this video, and you are aware of those tax force, it's important to tag the appropriate authorities who are supposed to clear them and take them off the road and so that people can go about their daily services or daily duties without any interruption. It's important we take this serious because if we don't, things will get more expensive and not just that, drivers will start avoiding transferring goods or maybe coming to your locality or coming to your state. When people start avoiding your state or start transferring goods to your state or start importing goods to your state, you will know how difficult it is to access some commodities. We really need to do better as Nigerians. We, really need, we need to do better as citizens of this country if we really want a better or a possible work in Nigeria because everything must not really, 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 really fall on the presidency or National Assembly or maybe the politicians. As citizens, we have the ones we should do by ourselves. We should be good citizens and then expect good governance. And when they don't bring that good governance, that is where we can ask for it or maybe demand for it. You cannot be demanding for good governance when you are a terrible citizen of the nation. It's not good. If you know about this, it's important to tell me your experience in the comment section or maybe tag the appropriate authorities. But before you do that, do not forget to support my TV projects. And before you also do that, don't forget to enjoy your weekend. Thank you.